custom homemade to fit headlight bucket. <clears throat> Angel got me a new one for Christmas. So, uh, being that we do absolutely nothing here anymore, and I haven't touched this thing in forever, let's just, uh, you know, throw this on there. That'll be fun. That'll be big progress and be pretty much ready to drive then. Um, yeah, so, uh, let's get started on that. restored to brand new. Um, she did buy me the right hardware. However, the clips that are on the fender um, are the wrong size now that these have been ran in there, so I need to get those. And then uh, they'll be ready to roll. So yeah, I got the battery charger on it so I can uh, Lift it back up because that back corner always leaks down or this front one leaks or one of them leaks. I don't remember. So I like to, you know, air it up every six months or so. So yeah, now I don't know what to do. That was my big project. I could take the other one off and clean it and paint it. Or I could leave it just like that. Um, yeah. Still, so, uh, Basically just waiting to test fit the engine in here so we can weld up the firewall trans tunnel. Which I could do. I just wanted to put the engine together, which I don't have a crank. I had a crank. Uh, something was wrong with it. I think, I don't know what the deal was, but the piston screws were hitting the counterweight. So they sent me the wrong one or it was mislabeled or I don't know what the deal was. So anyway, I just got rid of that. And uh, decided I was just going to buy a crate engine. Then I decided I'm poor because I have too many projects, so none of them get much money. They all just get a little bit. So this one seems to get the least. But uh, yeah, basically, I need a 350 crank. Um, and then the rest of that engine I have, I'll, except for the heads. Uh, we all know the story. I had an engine for this car, and it is now in that truck right there. So, that's that. I bought this new camera. We only made one video. <clears throat> now, what do I need to do? I don't have to I hammer it all this fucker. I mean, watch the language. I, mean, I, mean, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot you pulled that out. Sorry. We're not used to this anymore. <laughs> Sorry about that language. <laughs> that thing, I need to get in there. <clears throat> need to tune this up. <laughs> well, this camera has quite the uh, closeness feature. <laughs> mm, we need the, we need this. So you can know, grind all mm -hmm, those and mm -hmm, start mm -hmm, rolling mm -hmm, all. Mm -hmm. I guess. Yeah. Well, yes. mm -hmm. <laughs> That'd be awesome. <laughs> Could you imagine? Oh man, <laughs> we got everything done. Oh man, we need that. Oh, that looks so hard. It's gonna be hard to get up here to. Well, it wouldn't be hard if we were deleting this. We could weld this hole up. Anyway, since you're just tuning in, we converting to a uh, we converting to a firewall master, and we're just finishing it up by welding up some unneeded holes. Oh, but Jim wants to show how precise he measured for that hole. So, yeah. Oh, they don't line up. Perfect. This one's a little... Well, they didn't fit that bracket, either. They were a little off, remember oh, what I was Right. Anyway, so... What we got here is this. And then we, uh, you know... Did that, which goes to the dash where the column bolts through and bing bang boom. I'm not used to this camera, it's really weird. <clears throat> not 
welding up all the unnecessary holes from a million things that were on here. So you put a million more. And then I'll just have to figure out where to run the wiring later because we're wiring. Yeah, wiring because we're not using the stock wiring harness. We're deleting all the wiring. <laughs> Still not quite sure why I need brakes so I don't have an engine. It'll be fun to sit in here and push it up. It will. We can coast it down the driveway. We're good at pushing it up hills. We can you push it up. Show the parking brake. <laughs> <laughs> I will. I think I'll show it right now. Yeah. So. We decided we're going to leave this parking brake handle in here, so every time I stop before I when I park, I can uh, just go. And then, even though it doesn't do sounds anything, like it sounds cool. It sounds like you're really That's doing something. <laughs> right. So you're going to go, and then, uh, yeah. So that'll be cool. Anyway, was I supposed to be doing something? Not. Yeah, grinder. Grinder. You said I had to get inside and do something. Well, we were going to tune this hole we got to Oh, we were going to tune that hole up. I need the putty knife. The what? We need a lot of stuff. Well, I don't have a putty knife, but I have this. Let's just see. I know it's been, it's been a while since anyone's seen you work, so let's get a little bit of it. Well, as you can tell, <laughs> nothing has changed. There's only one of us doing something. Well, there's no camera person. Oh. That's what it is? Just so you're aware, this is the first time since the last video I made of being out here that we have been out here. So it's not like it's not like we're out here working on stuff and not filming anything. We're just not working on stuff. We're out here all the time. <laughs> like, don't let him fool you. <laughs> just nothing ever gets done. <laughs> right. Oh, I missed. Mm. So, apparently I got to do something. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I <laughs> <laughs> start doing like, like 30 seconds. Oh, I gotta go, I got something. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll have to see if we can get Angel back out here sometime, but she, she doesn't like it out here. It's cold and things. I just don't like it out here. I don't like cold. it out here either. Didn't make me turn the heat off. Oh, let's just take a look at that. The guy takes the sweatshirt off, says it's too hot in here. Let's see what we got. Uh-huh. Yep, way too hot in here. Gotcha. So, anyway. The only reason why I turned it off is I tried to take my shirt off. <laughs> <laughs> Just test for making sure it's right here. Alright, well. Well, let's check in when this is all done. Has motor, is running and driving. The <laughs> <laughs> next video. <laughs> Brakes, but nothing happened. Just a bunch of fluid came out of the side of the master cylinder, so we might have something going on there. Got some holes welded up. Show you what's going on inside here. All we have to do, as far as this goes, is come up with a stop for the pedal. So the uh, and most of the firewall goes back. It's Brace the dash, and the only problem with this, how it is now, if you know, if you really gas on it, <laughs> and, you, and then oh, oh no, oh, no brakes. So we just have to 
put a stop so this pedal can't come back and have the rod fall out. Other than that, this part is good. And you know, we just need to uh, build a plate for around this. Let's get rid of this clutch hole. And then pull this column tube off, paint it one more time. And uh, that's uh, done ish. And if I spend eight, I can get that one that comes with them. <laughs> and uh, then we need to, you know, finish welding the that in, which we haven't done because I wanted to fit the motor, which I don't have. So that's where we are here. <clears throat> and that's where Jim is over there. He's uh, finally taking a break. Finally taking that's a break. <laughs> And, uh, yeah. So there's your uh, biannual video. And, uh, yeah, I don't think we've even videoed your car yet at all. It's got quite the project over there in front of the Model A. It's a four wheeler. <laughs> He's got a lot of projects over there we need to look at. And, um, so don't forget to... I'm just going to check out your, per your uh, permanent temporary bike brake line clamps. <clears throat> As you can see, this is all done. Not with the two-tone brake line option. bracket for the what was the deal oh was this a single master single pot before so this converted it to a dual is that what it was <clears throat> so he welded this on here and then it went through the, well the clutch it wasn't on there though originally it was yeah it was oh no it went it was mounted somewhere around there but yeah it was mounted up because you went through the floor right so all that work, I drove the car two times. Now we changed it all, and we're gonna cut this off before we put the cross header back in. But we do have the uh, Turbo 350 training mount installed. I mean, we're gonna <laughs> box that up a little bit better. Stronger for all the high horsepower we're building. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Slide it up. So. <laughs> You're right, all that 150 horsepower. Right. I wish I had because I have none. If anybody has a 350 crank two piece rear main that's usable, I would like to sell. That would be great because I can't find one. Alright, good talk. See you in a year. <laughs>